Hello and welcome. I'm Saeed from StoryPlanet.net. Dive right into the essence of the most captivating books without reading them cover to cover. Whether you're on the go, at the gym, or just relaxing at home, we offer you a unique and enriching listening experience. Today, we are exploring the book. The Noise, a creation by Daniel Kahneman, Olivier Siboney, and Cass R. Sunstein. In Noise, 2021, the authors delve into the significant impact of randomness on human judgment. They reveal how noise, the inconsistency in decision-making, is inherent yet tricky to control. Nevertheless, by applying effective strategies, we can reduce noise in our judgments and promote fairness in society. Before we delve into these revelations, it's interesting to note that Daniel Kahneman, an economist and psychologist, authored Thinking Fast and Slow. He was awarded the Nobel Prize in Economics in 2002 and the Presidential Medal of Freedom in 2013. Currently, he is a retired professor at Princeton University. Cass R. Sunstein, a legal scholar, co-wrote Nudge with Richard Thaler. Formerly, he held a high-ranking position in the Obama White House and is now the founder of the Program on Behavioral Economics and Public Policy at Harvard University. Olivier Siboney, a fellow at Oxford University and a former senior partner at McKinsey & Company, authored You Are About to Make a Terrible Mistake. With eight key ideas to unveil, brace yourself for a deep dive into this captivating book on storyplane.net. To start, this text explores the topic of noise and its impact. The text discusses the concept of noise, or random mistakes in judgment, using the example of timing with a stopwatch. It highlights how such errors can have serious consequences and explains that variations in judgment can lead to unpredictable outcomes. The text also mentions the impact of narrative-seeking brains on decision-making and offers insights into the role of noise in various scenarios. Key idea number one, unexpected and unrelated factors can significantly influence human judgment. Unpredictable factors can significantly impact human judgments. External variables like weather, previous candidates, hunger and personal mood can influence decision-making in various professionals. This variability, known as occasion noise, is one of the major categories of noise affecting decision-making across different fields. Key idea number two, bias and noise are distinct concepts, with bias potentially causing noise. At a shooting arcade with a friend, one's shots are scattered, while the friend's shots cluster in a different pattern, leading to a discussion on bias and noise in judgments. Bias can cause a systematic errors, like conclusion bias altering asylum decisions. System noise occurs when judgments within a system are inconsistently varied, Understanding these concepts is crucial when assessing noise and bias in decision-making, whether in shooting targets or asylum cases. Key idea number three. Our predictions can be influenced by how they feel rather than being based on solid evidence. Bail judges face a tough decision on whether to grant bail or keep a defendant in jail pending trial. Human judges are not always accurate in predicting defendant behavior, leading to potential injustice. An algorithm developed in 2018 based on real-life bail hearings outperformed human judges in reducing jail populations and crime by 24 to 42 percent. Algorithms can provide better outcomes as they are not influenced by human biases and emotional signals that may lead to inaccuracies in predictions. Key idea number four. The text indicates that people tend to disregard or overlook things that are noisy or disruptive because they do not contribute to a compelling narrative. The text explains how humans are inclined to understand information through narrative structures but struggle to accommodate randomness, known as noise, as it doesn't fit into coherent stories. Noise, unlike bias, cannot be easily integrated into narratives and is often overlooked or misinterpreted. The piece highlights the challenge of recognizing noise in various decision-making processes which may appear biased at an individual level but exhibit random patterns when analyzed collectively. Key idea number five. To eliminate noise, average multiple independent judgments on one question. 
When human judgment is involved, noise can lead to serious consequences, and the concept of reducing noise by averaging independent judgments was highlighted through Francis Galton's ox weighing competition example in 1906. The wisdom of crowds effect reveals that averaging independent judgments tends to be close to the truth in various scenarios. However, certain conditions must be met for this to work effectively, such as judges being independent of each other and considering the same case. Although the wisdom of the crowd can cancel out noise, it does not eliminate biases that may be present in the group's judgments. Key idea number six, a noise audit is important to identify and address noise issues effectively. Judge Marvin E. Frankel noticed the variability in sentencing based on individual judges' biases. He conducted a study that revealed significant disparities in sentencing decisions. The key message is that to address this noise in judgment, a noise audit can be conducted to quantify the variability. Frankel's research showcased that shocking inconsistency was common in criminal sentencing. By defining a target level of variability and examining judges' decisions, institutions can identify and address the noise in their decision-making processes. Key idea number seven. Decision hygiene is a discipline focused on reducing noise through preventive measures, similar to how regular hygiene is about discipline and prevention. Implementing decision hygiene is compared to practicing regular hygiene, like washing hands. It involves discipline and prevention to reduce noise in decision making. The key step is to think statistically before making important decisions, avoiding narrative pitfalls and relying on the outside view. Premature intuition should be resisted. Emotional reward can mislead, and complex cases should be broken down for clarity. Key idea number eight, judges' agreement and acceptance are crucial for effective noise reduction efforts. In 1984, a law aimed at reducing sentencing variability was enacted based on numerical scoring, reducing noise in sentencing. However, the act was struck down later, leading to a return to sentencing disparities. The key lesson learned was the importance of judges agreeing on the purpose of judgment. Addressing noise requires judges to prioritize accuracy, understand the extent of variability, and formulate rules to balance reducing noise with other considerations. Noise reduction is crucial to prevent injustice and uphold faith in institutional systems. In conclusion, unwanted variability in human judgment is common and costly. Adopt principles of prevention to reduce noise. Tap into collective wisdom to counteract judgment variability. Averaging multiple independent judgments or asking yourself a question multiple times can lead to a more accurate answer. Example given with the question about the share of world airports in the United States being 32%. Thank you for listening to this summary. If you enjoyed this exploration, we invite you to discover other fascinating books on storyplanet.net. Don't wait any longer. A multitude of books, stories and knowledge await you there. See you soon on storyplanet.net.